oh, like, I, like, everything bad's happening. But thankfully, there's, there's four, uh, big, uh, black men here to help me. Well, the thing is, you know, Wonder Shows in is a show that's basically the crack alley of Sesame Street. Well, that was funny. Oh, I know, right? Do you do it again? <laughs> no. <laughs> but it's like basically the crack alley of Sesame Street. <laughs> Were you trying to do it again? No, I. I can't fucking barrel! You did it again, though! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Just go on! Now. Now. There you go. But, yeah. And the thing was, uh, it was like a little cartoon that they start that they did. Mm -hmm. And uh, when it started, it, uh, it's like this guy is this Jewish man walking home one day, gets brutally attacked, and he's just a Jewish guy, and he's like, "Oh, jeez, I'm in a bad part of town." And he sees some black people. It's like, "Oh no, those black people! I hope they don't beat me up." And he just starts laying down the street, going, "Oh, wait, help! I'm being attacked." And they're not doing anything. They're just like standing there, going, "Hey, man, <laughs> you want to just join in our, on, on our game?" And he's like, "No." And then he's like, he turns into like a He-Man kind of thing. Oh, and, oh and, the Jewish person. Yeah, and, it, and it's Hebrew. <laughs> and, and it's like through the power of being Hebrew, he starts beating them up for no reason. He's like, "You've just picked on the wrong Jewish guy." <laughs> it's like it's really dumb, but it's great. Yeah, but it's just like, that's what made the joke so funny to me, because like, you're like, you're supposed to be racist in order to get the joke funny. Uh, that's what made it so funny to me. That they literally made a joke so racist that it became anti-racist. Yeah. <laughs> Did you know a crocodile can support up to two chimpanzees on its mouth? Up to two monkeys. But any higher than two, and then it dies? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I never noticed that it actually there's a hand controlling a lava hand. Yeah. Lava hand? Because for the most part, lava. you don't see it later on. Oh, it's more than a lava hand. It's like a, a skeleton lava. Yeah, it's a whole skeleton underneath there. He just likes to live in the lavas. Good for you. Get out of the lava! <laughs> Get out of the lava! <laughs> it's like Tim the Tool Man's in the lava. <laughs> oh! <laughs> So we have Jaws in the lava, we have Jim the Tool Taylor in the lava. Were they fighting each other at some point or something? Probably. <laughs> it's like, this is how we're gonna do it. We're gonna fight. Oh. Yeah, Jaws, Jaws versus Tim the Tool Man Taylor. I think it's a pretty even monster fight. Yeah. It's like the... <laughs> Tim the Tool Man Taylor is like one of the greatest monster villains in, in uh, <coughs> 80s. <laughs> monster villain culture. He's like Freddy Krueger and Jason Voorhees. <laughs> well, yeah, I know. Being monster people. First try! Pizza, pizza. It's your actual first try. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, 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 Pizza, pizza. Yeah! So you caught up to me? You just, you just wanted swag on me? Yes, I did. Pizza. Monkeys don't need a DJ. Stop. They're, they're murdering them. They're just children! <laughs> Well, they are all children. Like Tim Allen. <laughs> He's laughing. <laughs> That's a pretty good joke. <laughs> <laughs> Please stop! Stop! No! No! The massacre! They're killing them! No! No! And then they're gonna kill me! No! It's like, what do you have to gain? What do you have to gain? <laughs> Just kill Diddy so you get the O. No, it's not. Why? Because then Diddy will be dead. But Diddy. then you can resurrect Diddy. Diddy is dead. This game promotes necromancy. This game promotes... child murder. That's fine. So does Contra, I think. Contra is like... And Animal Crossing. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> didn't think it's so funny now, Al! Did ya? <laughs> it's Tim, not Al! Tim Allen. No, you can't! I because would... he literally has a person, a sidekick, his name Al. Yeah. How dare you? How do you not know your your tool? <laughs> the tool <dual> time lore. <laughs> like honestly. <laughs> and then at some point in the in the middle of the seasons, I think probably seasons three and four, he becomes Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> and 
Okay. Here he starts doing horrible things. <laughs> this horrible san <laughs> Santanic rituals. <laughs> Santanic? <laughs> <laughs> San Santa Tan Santana, yeah, Santa. <laughs> and then Jill's there. <laughs> <laughs> Anything you could do, I can't do better. I can't just do it because you're better than me. Yeah. Just murder them all. <laughs> no rhinos! Well, that's how you get it. Okay, yeah. cool. You use the DK coin. And he just leaves. <laughs> do not fall for anything! Yeah, you do. I don't. Oh! Oh! Uh, wow. And then he sacrifices himself to give you the cannon, which. Uh, dude, I forgot all about that. You were so much better than me, Travis. Destroy them all! <laughs> Total genocide. This is our genocide run of Donkey Kong Country 2. Donkey Kong Country 2, Donkey Kong Country 1. <laughs> <laughs> Donkey Kong Country 2, Donkey Kong Country 4? One thing, they already have a Donkey Kong Country 4 for another thing. It's not called Donkey Kong Country 4. For another, you can't have two as a four. Do you think Donkey Kong was a bro? Yeah, it's Diddy who's not a bro. No, I mean like an actual bro, like, like bro stuff and stuff uh, like that. Yeah. But I don't know, little buddy. I, I kind of want like some uh, bananas. I just kind of want some bananas. And steroids. GDK? <laughs> you just kinda got like a drug problem or something. <laughs> well, who's the one that told me to do drugs, Diddy? Who's the one that told me to do drugs? <laughs> I guess it was me. <laughs> no means yes, Diddy. No means yes. Oh no. And then, say no to and drugs. then DK goes on a say droid range. Say no to drugs. It's say yes to drugs. Say no to drugs. Say yes to cocaine. What? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Where are they getting electricity? Yeah. Oh, oh, you totally ruined it. You botched it. I did botch it. You well, botched it. You botched it twice! I... <clears throat> oh. You can hit him, but just... Yeah, that's hey. the front part. There's a bell right yeah, there! Yeah, there was, but I didn't want to hit him. Okay. I didn't want you to feel bad. Thanks. Because I appreciate you're not, that. You're not in danger. You're, you're a real good friend, Travis, and by a real good friend, I mean you're a decent friend. By a decent friend, I mean you don't beat me up. <laughs> <laughs> and by you don't beat me up, I mean you don't leave any bruises. <laughs> Beating with a bag of oranges, don't leave a bruise. <laughs> you know what pisses me off the most, though? Yeah. Is that that new Scooby Doo thing that looks like a Segway Farland reject or something? It's actually good. It annoys me to death. How good it actually is. Okay. It doesn't make sense. I don't sense. even like Scooby Doo. I don't. I straight up don't like Scooby Doo. <laughs> it was always on when I was a kid, so I never liked it. Scooby Scooby Doo, where are you? You've got some work to do now. Oh, gee, Freddy, I'm not sure if you should be in this haunted house. <laughs> <laughs> well, come on, Daphne, quit being a little bitch. It's just Dick Cheney's house. <laughs> hey, I hope there aren't any ghosts around. Yeah. <laughs> and George Bush is the best character. <laughs> well, it's okay, Shaggy and Scooby. There aren't any ghosts yet. He starts killing everyone. Right, Scooby Doo is a, is a terrible cartoon. Yay, Mr. Pubbles is here finally. Yay, he gets his All right, the stream's crap. over. What? <laughs> Oh great, now we actually start having to have good commentary, we have someone actually watching. We have more people, we have four people watching. Oh, well, three people watching. I don't like this. One person watching. <laughs> <laughs> Bounce! So it can only get good when we start talking about Scooby-Doo, the terrible cartoon show. We're terrible people. Yeah, because Scooby-Doo has the best of content. <laughs> I just... Hey gang, we got a mystery on that. Easily, like, the best Scooby-Doo. Like, old Scooby-Doo yeah. is the one where they have the guests. Yeah. Like, it's Batman. The Harlem Globetrotters. <laughs> I love the Harlem Globetrotters. Because <laughs> I actually used to watch their show, and I knew about their powers beforehand. I was like, are they going to have their powers in this one? And they did. And they didn't solve it for, like, they didn't, like, they ran away from the ghost. And they had the powers. They had the powers, and they ran away from the ghost. Did it make sense? Yeah. <laughs> 
Here's the thing about Family Guy. Remember that cutaway where Peter uh, juggled three pianos? What? Because <laughs> yeah. this is pretty much all cutaways. All right, yeah. Okay. <coughs> so my joke is not that far off the mark. No, it's not. Oh, it's... I lost. I'll just give up now. No, because you don't want to do it as did he? Yeah. <clears throat> did you know dude, he's the worst, <laughs> worst OC? No, I went around in circles, didn't I? No, you're going away. Okay, good. Follow the banana arrows. I'm trying to follow the banana arrows. It's dark in here. No, it's dark. I'm mad that they that they got rid of the uh, the, the white flashes from the flashlight. I am not. But that was my favorite thing. That is literally only your favorite thing because of how annoying it is. Like ah, uh, blind you. I like how that's your thing. If something's annoying, you love it. <laughs> like Shrek. Shrek is love. Shrek is love. Do you want to start talking about Shrek on my stream? On our stream? <clears throat> on our highlights? Yeah, maybe. We have to talk about Shrek. Shrek. You know, just that ogres are like onions. How are ogres like onions, Travis? Huh? Because they have layers. And ogres have layers. Oh, I'm starting to see onions that. Onions have layers? You get it. We both have layers. Do humans have layers? <clears throat> Are they onions too? Yeah, you could be an onion. Yeah, you could be an onion. What if, what if the Sonic fandom was replaced with a Shrek, with a Shrek fandom and they had Shrek OCs? <laughs> I would, I would be okay with that. Because you'd be part of it. Yeah, really. I, I would be part of it. <laughs> would like, you check, actually? Check out my cool Shrek OC. He's long lost brother of Shrek. I call him Shrek. 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 Yeah. And he's like, uh, he, he, but he's like. He has more layers than Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, because because the whole thing would be about layers. <laughs> like their layer power level. And then, and then Shrek would have his own own cartoon from the nineties, and, and he'd be like, and he'd be like, Donkey, I'm waiting. <laughs> Why would Shrek go fast? And then he'd be like, Two onions, please, <laughs> with extra onions. <laughs> Yeah. Stupid! So stupid! Oh jeez. You can just hop on the dragonflies. Yeah, I know, but I'm too scared throw to Diddy. do it. Throw Diddy at him. No! You can throw Diddy at him. I know him. you can, but you, like, he dies. No, he doesn't. Yeah, he does! If you hit it, if you don't, only if you don't hit them right. Oh, oh, that do hard now. Now you, now you unlocked hard mode. <laughs> Isn't that weird how Diddy is actually hard mode? Oh, you did it. Oh, hit the B. Yes! Oh! Yes! Really? Yes! Wow! And now, and now I have a chance to shine. The most American thing you could do is eat a cold cheeseburger while you're driving in traffic. And on like the freeway. I've done that. <laughs> <laughs> Say something so American that you have done. Yeah. It's like, oh, I'm just gonna eat this cold cheeseburger that I had sitting in my car all day. Why? Because I didn't get a chance to eat it earlier <laughs> while I'm on the freeway. Sure, that's great. <laughs> but New York people can't always do that. The majority of people that live in New York don't have cars. Yeah. Because they're poor, I think. No, it's because cars are impractical in New York. And they're poor! Say it with me. <laughs> because they're poor. <laughs> that's not true at all. But I, I like to think of that way that Donald Trump is the one that's taking all the money from the New Yorkers. Okay. <laughs> like he regularly mugs people. <laughs> Donald Trump shows up. I'm just taking all the money because I'm Donald Trump. <laughs> I'm rich. No. What the? You asshole. 